And let's see if we can't... Oh, this thing is definitely a little bit top-heavy. What happens if we do this? Oh! <laughs> I don't think we're supposed to be up here, guys. Oh! <coughs> Whoa, excuse me. All right, everybody. Welcome back to Crossout. So, this is where we're at in the world right now. So, I've got two accounts, mind you. My own personal one. And then there's a press one that I can show off some cool stuff, which we're going to be doing. But... There's something to be said about grinding and getting what's yours, right? So we're gonna hop into a battle. We're gonna use our basic machine gun truck. We're gonna attempt to unlock some shotguns. We're gonna be experimenting with lots of different weapon systems in Crossout, but right after we're done, we're gonna be making ourselves a custom vehicle. All right, so we're in battle. Look at this guy. So half the fun of battling, well not half the fun, but a decent portion of the fun is like seeing the derpy designs that your teammates have. This guy's got a cannon on the front and he's got a machine gun on the top. The machine gun can't even clear the cannon. Oh, hello friend. And this guy's got blades on the front. I think that's probably what we should do next is put some blades. So we're gonna go across this bridge. Oh, <laughs> and let's see how this works out. I'm just gonna kind of sit back and get some, like, you know, get some pot shots. And by pot shots, I mean just kind of whittle them down. Oh, we're getting shot at from below? Truly? Man, look at this. Our team wrecked. I wasn't expecting us to just break through like this. Yeah, we got some assists. We're doing some damage. Maybe not a lot. Well, this guy's got a blade. I don't want him to hit me. And I don't want them to focus on me either. I'm kind of going to hang back. Where's that other guy? I know he's there. Oh, sorry, bud. All right. So I think we're probably going to go for a capture now. We kind of need to, don't we? Oh, there's a bad guy behind me. Look at the minimap. Where is he at? All right. Let's get some capture points, though, because if we win by cap, we want to be there. That's half of this game. The battles are fast. They're furious. A lot can happen in a short amount of time. You need to adapt, and you need to be there to maximize the points. Otherwise, you're just not going to get too many. Now, this guy is taking one for the team, and he's coming in here to try to stop us, stall us. So we got to eliminate him fast. Enemy destroyed. We got the kill. All right. So we did a fair amount of damage. Look at this guy. He's missing some wheels. His car's smoking, but we got the victory. Now... I'm hoping for at least, I was going to say at least 700 points, but 1,000 is usually when you know you did pretty good. Let's check the overall stats. We got second place on the team, so we're going to come back to the garage. Now, this is a key component of Crossout. Look at that. It's like, Rarrr! everything's going crazy. And then you get back, and you got your friend Billy Bob Joe on the classic guitar. He's like, hey there, Byron, you look like you're putting the machine guns on your Crossout vehicle here, all right? Dude, uh, if he talks like that. I'd be okay with it. Maybe you guys might not be. But you need to check yourself. So, now it chills out, and we go into build mode. Now, what I'm looking for is I'm looking for some blades. Now, what section would these be in? It's been such a long time since I've played Cross Out. I would think of... What? A hatchet. They're called hatchets, and they call it a mine. So, we're going to put two here. Now, I need to learn the, uh, the quick... Oh, maybe I'm gonna put some plating on this thing, right? So some extra panels will slow us down, but it will also give us greater survivability. There will be a trade-off. Maybe we should have put that on it. I don't want it over there, because then it would, yeah, you know what we're gonna do? Here we go. I've got an idea. We're gonna put those there. We're gonna put those there for now. And we're gonna get this little bumper here, and we're gonna put it, yeah. We're gonna grab these. Here we go. They, it wouldn't let me manually do it, but when I hover over this, that's strange stuff. All right, so we've got two blades in the front. We've got this extra grill. Now look at this. The extra grill. It's a van bumper. It's got a power. It's got structure of 72 points. It also adds 109 kilograms of mass, right? And it adds a power score value. So that means our power score goes up. Our overall. I guess you'd call it battle rating if you're familiar with a war thunder. And it's always, what's this? A carjack. Okay, that automatically flips us, but it should use a point of energy. And I'm wondering, do I really need that? I don't know if I need a carjack. I don't know if I need a carjack. What is this? A buggy bumper and a terrible, a terrible bar. 
But so what we're looking for is lightweight armor. These buggy grills are usually pretty good. Structure of 12 points. What was the one we just put on? I wish we we could hover over it. Radiator grill. Structure of nine. So these buggy grills, there's definitely, oh yeah, it's lower power score, but greater structure. Oh, see, that's why these are lower mass. So maybe this would be good and we can, what? Put it right here. Put her there, partner. And look at that, some extra armor plates, right? So hopefully making us a bit more survivable. I've said that probably 10 million times. Oh, and you know what? We don't have two of those. So it's not gonna look all super nice. Oh yeah, mass of 45. We definitely want lower weight stuff. A gun mount? Wait a minute. Can we put that on the top? I'm gonna put that over the engine. And I'm gonna put this machine gun up higher. I wonder, that makes this look so much cooler, doesn't it? Now we got these blades, see, and look at that. Now we've got what, what is the power score here? Let's let's go ahead back to the build menu. 1699, and this too could be yours for one small payment. Actually make that 12 payments of 1699. We're gonna go into battle once again. I'm hoping to get some melee stuff with regards to like using my blades. Look at this, average wait time, three seconds. It lived up to its hype. Game starting in five seconds. We've got a full load of enemy people. I think the biggest power score over there. Look at that. That stupid bumper on the left side. It's like, why? Why do we do this? All right. Now I got... Oh, my blades don't really stick out. But maybe that means... Huh. I'm not sure if that's good. We could always adjust that. But I, I like this. This is one of the key areas of why I'm really enjoying it. All right. So I'm going to stay... In the herd, we're gonna we're gonna do a little zergling attack. Look at that guy, little six wheeler. That thing's all kinds of silly. We got three MGs. Oh, what's up, friend? <laughs> that was perfect timing. I mean, I didn't. Yeah, I totally knew that was gonna happen. Skirt. Now we're gonna head over here. We're gonna follow Kyle. Looks like was that machine gun or cannon? Oh god, the whole enemy team's here. Now if no one's shooting at me, I'm gonna kind of stick to my spot. We're getting slowly whittled down. We're at 385. We're pretty good. Oh god, let's 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 maneuver. Wow, we're at half. Oh god, we lost some wheels. We lost some wheels. This is bad. This is bad. But we're behind these pylons here. And if they're not focusing on me, that's fine with me. Because we're gonna we're gonna jump. Oh, that's a friend. All right, so there's only two left. We lost both the wheels on our left side, so we put that bumper. I'm wondering if we might be able to put some armor plating around our tires. But at this point, we're pretty much demobilized. We've got some assist. We've got that kill. I think our score should be decent. Um, but most, but for the most part, we're pretty much boned. Now, maybe the thing we want to look for is <laughs> this is this is an effort and this is a lesson in futility right here guys this ain't good so we're just gonna sit here we're capturing the enemy base good for you guys wait there was only four people on the enemy team hey you see that someone's firing machine guns at me there you go he's dead all right win 10 battles against live players that's what's up i am all that is man all right so Stats overall, we were second place. We're gonna head back to the garage because we saw how, it's funny, like this doesn't really protect the wheels. I'm sure you can. So I'm gonna get rid of that. Now we've got this added little height advantage on this turret. I wonder if we could put like an auto cannon on it or something. But then you'd wanna protect everything you could, right? Yeah, see, it's got this little, like, van ramp and then a van side, both of which add to the armor. So, I'm wondering if maybe there's better tires. So, we've got what? There's medium wheels. Got a structure. Oh, wow. Medium wheel steering. We got racing wheels. Light wheel with above average durability and tonnage. Each mounted wheel reduces cabin power. What? Reduces cabin power. So we've got these small wheels. 
We got three steering. We could do these. Let's try it. Wow, these are big. But they are hopefully looked at. Okay, so structure of 100 health versus 50. They're twice as strong, and they're the steering ones. We definitely want that. Oh, yeah, those, are, those were starter wheels anyway. So now that we've got that, we've got our blades. Actually, one of the things we wanted was to kind of put them out further. So we're gonna need one little plate. We need a magical plate here. How are we gonna get it? Avia panel? I'm hoping you're light. 54 kilograms isn't the lightest. Maybe something a dune buggy plate. That wouldn't work. That wouldn't work either. I think we might have to use these small struts. No, those won't work either. Will they? Yeah. Yeah, those won't work. Okay, so we need to find something different. We might just have to use an avia panel. That's what I'm gonna do here. All right, now we're gonna put our wheel, our, our blades on it, our hatchets. Ooh, that actually acts as kind of like armor of sorts. Now, hopefully, look at that. Th doesn't this thing look really cool? All right, so then um, we've got what? The power score of 1734. We only went up a little bit. We're gonna battle once more. And now, how I'm gonna do these episodes is we're gonna try out crazy things, but then we're also gonna do be doing the grinding and battling. All right, so we're about to pop into a battle. You can see the power scores are ramping up. We've got people in the high teens and low 2000s. So I'm not the biggest, <laughs> look at this, an unforeseen consequence, or we should have seen it, is we actually ride a little lower in the back than we do in the front, because we got medium wheels in the front, but small wheels in the back. This is pretty funny. I don't know how I get really good, oh, uh oh, where they at, where they at? Oh, back up, back this up. We got 420 health, boys. All right. So let's see, where... Oh. Cover and fire! We're getting like dinky dink damage. And there's more enemies over here than there are enemies. What? That was redundant and incorrect. Factually incorrect. There are more enemies than friends over here. So what we're going to be doing... Oh, they're moving in. Is we're going to try to find where our friends are and reinforce them, right? This is a cool little area. Yeah, we're not riding very well with the mix of mediums and lights. All right, let's see if we can't get some rams. Blades ready! Oh, we shot his cannon off. All right, so then we gotta, oh, that guy was coming in. Make ourselves narrow. Oh, dude, that grill in the front is absorbing stuff. I don't think we've lost a wheel yet. All right, let's flank back here. We've got an enemy on our six o'clock. Oh my God, his cannon just missed us. All right, so we're, we're coming around here. We've got two friends that are also circling around. So we're, we're, there's one guy here we can catch. That guy lost the wheel. He's down as maneuverable. Oh, sorry, bud. Yes, enemy destroyed. All right, so we rolled in there. We need medium wheels so bad. Oh, that's funny. Here, maybe we can flip our friend, Bishkura. Hey, Bishkura. Let's see, how do I flip you? There you go, buddy. Hey, what's up, dude? Get back in the battle. All right, so it's 58 seconds. Um, I'm gonna run through here with my friend Bishkura. Bishkura. Come on, bud. We're gonna take this. We're gonna take this for the blue team. Blue team's better. Oh my god. Terrible driving. Yeah, it's it's. We're slightly less good at driving with medium wheels. We are capturing the enemy base. Oh, oh. Thought that may have been a bad guy. I wonder if we can cap before this 30 seconds is over. I don't know where the other guy's hiding at, but I think we should be able to capture, and that will give me even more points. Oh, he got destroyed. Someone hunted him down, took him out of the game. Uh, 705, not bad overall stats. Second place, kind of a small game. I think we need to return to the garage here, though, because look at this. <laughs> These things ride lower, and it definitely affects stuff. I want, I want better wheel. All right, we got ourselves in a decent map, 8v8. 
Now, like I said, if you just kind of want to play conservative and generally safer, doesn't mean you're going to win all the time, hang back with the crew. Now, look at that. We've got four friends in front of us, so if we kind of just stick with the Zerg... Should we go... Should we... Let's do a ramming attack. I mean, that's why we put blades on this thing. All right, that's dangerous. Oh! All right, ramming speed! Oh, our blades versus his blades. Yeah! We just wrecked him. Oh, man, my friends were all in the way. I couldn't even get some shots. Wait, are they... They're attacking our base! Return to base! Ooh, that guy got... Lost the wheel. Oh, no. Ramming speed! Oh! We gotta, we gotta bypass these guys. Come on, guys. We gotta get back to the zone. Where, where's the capping happening? Oh no, I think I went the long way. We might not be able to get back there, so... This is where a fast vehicle, like the Snappy, which we showed off... I Was it on the live stream or just in the last video in general? I'm gonna have to make an honorable sacrifice, because here's the cap. If there's one or two of them, I'm definitely gonna die. There's one. Open fire! I gotta get in there. Hopefully I stopped it. Oh, we missed! Blades! Oh, I don't... Alright, I'm targeting... I'm trying to target his machine guns. He had, he had these things blocking him. I just saved the game, guys. I just saved the game! Yeah! What's up now? How you, and you know what? We didn't get rewarded for it. However, we leveled up to... Man! That's some crap. See, the, someone think... You know how, like, in basketball, people are like, He's a real good ball player. He's a complete, you know, shooting... He's a complete guard. And he gets a lot of stati- you know, he gets a lot of things that don't show up on the scoreboard. That's what we just did. Alright, but the cool thing was, now, we leveled up to level 5. Attention, survivor. Copper is very important for production of armored vehicle parts. You can get copper for taking part in raids. I mean, didn't we just do that? Or is there more stuff? Now, oh, what's a raid? PvE! Okay, let's try this out. Let's do bridge defense. I'm gonna try this out. Um, fortress. Defending a fort? Yeah. I'm gonna see what this is, I mean. All right, we're in a raid. It looks like me and uh, three of my brothers, including Sekira with a 3,700 power score vehicle. Hey, friend, what a team player. I'm tra ta 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 Okay, we gotta protect this fortress here. Pump jacks defended, zero out of three, okay. Man, I think I remember doing something like this a long time ago. So here's Shakira. She's got an auto cannon on her. We're gonna call her Shakira from now on. We gonna we gonna go dancing with Shakira. Shakira, where they at? You see anybody, guys? I'm not seeing nothing. He's got two machine guns and the auto cannon. Oh, here we go. Ban it. Oh. Oh, it doesn't say if you got any assists or not. All right, we got this guy here. Boom! Spike, son! I'm just manhandling this thing. All right. So the thing about it is we don't have to worry about ammunition, but what I remember in the last game was you did have to worry about... If you had cannons, you, you'd have to save them. So you'd almost have different builds for different game modes. I mean, that would make sense, right? Spikes! Man, our, our machine guns overheat. It'd be nice to have, like... Oh, these things are very durable cabins. I want one of those. I could build a Humvee or a Jeep-looking thing. All right, where's where's my team at? Now, how are we doing on wheels? Our wheels are good. Our blades are still up. All three machine guns are still operable. Next wave in seven seconds. Whee! Defense successful. Now, do we stay at this one, or do we have to move to another one? I think... Oh, never mind. It says protect over here. All right, let's go. This is interesting. It's a totally different map. It looks like World War II happened here. Oh, look at that. So, when we're not there to protect it, the timer goes down. Like, how much points? So, we got to get there. Oh, they're shooting at it. Spikes! Dude, I just demobilized that thing, too. Now let's take out his... Yeah, we took out his guns. Wait, who's that? Oh, that's friendly. 
And then I'm, I'm gonna worry about the guys that are attacking it. Oh, we just took a wheel off again. So these spikes are excellent. They excel. Oh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go stab it, you idiot. Jeez. Moonlight's like, I'm gonna do my thing, I swear. Sometimes you, you, you see people in these games that do stuff like that, and you're like, I'm like, I wonder. I imagine them as like pro magnets, like, oh, they know that they shall play the games, okay? I mean, I don't know why they had some terrible British accent, but they did. Now, let's see if these things get harder and harder. Yeah, so you can imagine if you only had 10 cannon rounds, you could have used all that already. Yo, get out of here. This is my turf. Spikes! Oh. <laughs> that was fun. All right, now we got to go over here. Protect, so we're actually on the way. I'm going to move over there first. I'm going to be one of the first to get there. We're going we're gonna to do this for America. I mean, even though there's probably no America in this setting anymore. Because all the countries probably are destroyed. Now it's just wandering. Oh, what was that? A flare? Something's going on over there. All right, let's get to the high ground. Oh, wait. Oh, hello. We got to protect two. Wow! Where did all these guys come from? All these little guys with machine guns on them? Oh, get spiked, son. Oh, man, I almost flipped. But we do have a jack. What's that? What's that purple thing? Is that a bot? Oh, my God, it's a bad guy with a drill. Holy crap. We might lose wheels. We did. We did. We lost one of our front wheels. This thing's got a freaking auger on the front of it. Run! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh no! We gotta take out his. Oh no 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 no! Don't don't drill me, bro! Oh shit! Come on, this auger! Oh no! He's chasing me! This is terrible! Oh, he's he's getting me! He just took out another wheel! Okay, we took away his drill now. So screw you, you jerk. But luckily this is the third out of three. And they don't have very good guns, but I would imagine you can, you know, the higher level you are, maybe the, the bigger and badder they are. Look at that. Our triple machine guns. We can't move right now. Come on. Let's target the guys with working guns. Oh, he ran into my spikes. Hopefully that helped. Oh, yeah, so if we have an auger, we got to remember to aim at their uh, wheels with it. Look at this, man. So it's basically just like, I think we've sealed the deal here. There's Shakira. Shakira, Shakira. All right, enemies remaining three, but I can't go out and look for them. Pump jacks have been defended. Oh, my God, it's a boss. Oh, and, and of course I'm right in his way. Oh, he got... Yes! He's got a cannon on him. All right, I'm going to aim for the cannon. It's going to take a lot. Oh, please don't please don't hit me, bro. So this is the medalist. Oh, he's coming right for me. He's not using his cannon. Yes! He's disabled. Now we just got to get rid of his cannon. He was still firing, though. All right, is there... Yeah, there's one bad guy over here. Man, so luckily we turned into a pillbox in the right spot. Oh, that auto cannon is probably amazing at taking out. I definitely feel like I would want an auto cannon for these. Oh, hello. One last one, and then we've won the game. I'm wondering if we should show off stealth technology or what. All right, defense successful. So we did that. Let's see what the loot is. Are these things worth it? 670 points. For the amount of time we spent doing that, we probably could have, but I think you get specific rewards. We got copper and we got coupons as a resource. Who uses coupons? Shotgun raids. Okay, special missions. Win seven battles, install shotguns, and complete it. Oh, win seven battles in raids? You only get 25 bolts for that? Destroy 50 AI vehicles in raids using shotguns? Oh, man. But I wonder how much return to the garage? Heck yes. All right, so 
We've unlocked some stuff, we've leveled up, now it's time to show off the big guns. Alright guys, so now we're going to be showing off some of the weapon parts and the vehicles that we want to aspire to be, the parts that we want to get, so that we can build the biggest and baddest. Now one of the coolest ways to do that is to see what other people are making, what they have made. Oh my god, this thing looks epic! Let's go ahead and test drive this bad boy. Look how this thing is just a speed demon looking vehicle. Oh, it looks like American Muscle, and it looks like we've got a shotgun and a machine gun. Let's see how our damage is. Shotgun's reloading. Oh, you can see those 40 bursts of damage from the shotgun. Okay, so let's go back to the exhibition, and um, let's see if there's any cool contraptions we can play with. What is that? I don't think this does anything. Test drive. Okay, someone just made a fish. They made a fish, and they painted it. And <laughs> someone really just made a fish. You gotta be kidding me. Ooh, this thing looks cool. It's a scorpion. Oh man, so it's got blades. I don't think they're functional. We're gonna test drive it. Yeah, we've got we've got some shotguns. There's one hanging down from the tail here, as like the. Uh, and then, yeah, so the pincers don't actually work, unfortunately, but man, creativity galore right there. All right. So we got Bomber, we got a Desert Bear, Mad Jack, we've got Flying Car. Whoa, this is a trike? I gotta try this out. If this thing works, it does! It's a three-wheel vehicle! It has no weapons, this is just for fun. Oh my god, I love the creativity. Look at this thing! This thing is so fast. Let's see how much air we get. Look at that, since we have no weapons, we're like... <laughs> That's pretty cool. Okay, I wanna try out that, that flying car. I wanna see what this is all about. Okay, so we've got, we've got what looks like multiple engines. So we've got one on the top. Oh, okay, D now we are in position. Lift off in three. Two, one. Oh my gosh! If we put wings on this thing, could we fly? Oh, this is gonna hurt. Oh man. Okay, the car's flipped. <laughs> this is awesome! Look at this thing! Oh my gosh, it's like a spinning top. Alright, let's test drive this again. And let's see if we can't... Oh, this thing is definitely a little bit top-heavy. What happens if we do this? Oh! <laughs> I don't think we're supposed to be up here, guys. But we are. Okay, we're gonna, we're gonna wait. This is gonna be the launch platform. Alright, once that, once that left booster's ready, we're gonna put ourselves in a position. Like so. And lift off! Oh, this thing just wants to go real far. Oh, wow! <laughs> Look at that! We landed on the ramp! Okay. Dude, this is so cool! You can have so much fun going off into space! Oh my gosh, yes! <gasps> Look at the moon! Hold on. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? I know you are. We gotta find a knife. Oh. Alright. And flip us! Oh, we're going into- we're going into space! Yes, we are. Oh! <laughs> we got on top of the building! Oh, it's- it- we're not supposed to be up here. Look, you can't- Okay. Can we- look at- I, I never would have expected us to be in these situations. Alright, I'm not trying to go that way. I'm trying to get up here. Oh! Oh! This thing is fast! Alright, ready? We- we- we're gonna have liftoff from the space station. I'm actually only going backwards. Oh, don't fall off! Ah! <laughs> that actually saved us from falling. Okay. Now, I'm gonna go off into space using that ramp right there. That big one we see. This is awesome. Okay. Lift off in five, four, three. Moon, can you hear me? We're coming home, baby. We're coming home. All right. And. And. Oh! Yes! <laughs> oh, this thing breaks so much. Okay, I want to see if there's any more flying vehicles because holy crap, that was fun. 
Oh, we got a nice little dune buggy. We got uh, really cool looking drag cars. Fly. Yep, here we go. Oh, wait a minute. Another fly. What does this even mean? Oh, okay. Oh, <laughs> yeah. We're, we're, oh, oh my gosh. Guys, oh my. We may have, we almost got into orbit. Okay, and fly again. <laughs> okay, let's try this one again. So this one definitely takes off. Oh no. <laughs> you, there's like this invisible wall. Why is this so fun? Okay, what if I... Oh no. Oh no, we're gonna... Oh, we didn't even make it that time. Oh! We just shattered ourselves. Alright, there were other flying vehicles. Fly. Test drive. Okay. We do have wheels, so we can position ourselves. Now, for some reason, we have this... These weird things. Oh, it looks like we're gonna fly the other way. Oh! Whoops! Oh, that didn't work at all. Come on. All right, let's flip it again. Yes! Okay. All right. Oh my god, this thing, this thing does not wanna, this thing does not wanna move. Okay. Hit the brakes, and now we're going into space. <clears throat> so there's the moon. Oh, yes. Oh, I wanna, I wanna be able to press them again. Break. Oh, yeah. We are flying. Okay. There's gotta be someone made a plane or something in here, right? We have these rocket boosters for sure. <clears throat> now, do we have jet turbines? Because if we do, we could try to build our own tank. Hatchback? What the heck is that? There's some crazy designs. I can't wait till like another week from now. <gasps> what is this? Oh my god, it's a twin turret tank. Oh my gosh, this thing is this thing is a beast. Hey, why can't I see myself over there? You may fire when ready. Twin cannon bursts. Oh my god, this is a veritable land battleship. Can we take this thing into action? You're missing several parts. Apparently I'm missing all the parts. Wait, I wanted to save this one. Where's that? Where did it go? There it is. We're gonna save it, and we're gonna see if we can't load it. Okay, we're gonna go to blueprints. Load. Yes. Oh my god, we're missing all the parts. Dang it. Okay. Well, let's go back to exhibition and uh, load that bad boy up. Where did he go now? He ain't even there. He ain't even there. We may have moved him. Or maybe someone updated a vehicle. That's weird. Oh, this is a really cool vehicle. Military APC. There it is. All right. Come on, show me out there. What? That's weird. Normally you see yourself. But this thing is awesome. The best tank in the game, potentially. I wonder what the power score is. Actually, it probably showed it. Alright, you know what? Let's spawn in some bots. Did we? Oh, yeah, we did. Enemy sighted. You may fire when ready. Oh, twin hits. We're getting rammed. This is like... You know what? I, would, I was thinking we'd do a little bit more damage with this thing. Oh, that guy just got obliterated. Rotate, but the cool thing is that they're rotatable. <laughs> this guy flipped by himself. Goodbye, Mr. Bonds. Oh, he can flip. You may be able to flip yourself, Jim, but you're gonna die. All right, so that would definitely be the best tank in the game, man. Look at that. Oh, yeah. It's just so gorgeous. All right, rotate the turrets and fire. It's like a freaking Death Star. Wow, one of 
One of the cannons is more out of ammunition than the other one. We must have been firing with it and didn't even know. Oh, you know what? I wasn't pressing both buttons. How silly of me. I literally was not. Let's let's try that again and pretend that never happened. Spawn in the bots, bring me the enemies. We're gonna be firing both guns now as opposed to just one. That was that was silly. I thought they were synced to the same button, which you can do. Here we go. And you could you could alternate fire. Like so. Or you can twin fire, obviously. Alright, rotate the turrets. Dude, this thing is speedy. That was a twin shot. You can kind of see the individual circles. There we go. Dude, this is the best tank in the game, guys. There's just no doubt about it. I want to explore more with um flying. But guys, alright, so let's go, let's go to this. I need to show you the factions to kind of show you their vehicles. Specifically the lunatics, was it? Oh, so this is Beast. This is Wa. One of these guys has a cloaking device. It might be... Standard Lunatic. Spring... Hmm. Who was it? The Nomads? One of these guys has a cloaking device. I, I At least in the closed beta test. Anyway, there's a number of vehicles... What should we do in the next one? Look at this weird bird gas mask guy. He looks funny. It looks like this is like the bot from Portal, right? Anyway, guys, so thank you for watching. My name is Baron. Two videos a day. Crossout is proving to be so much fun. There's so much to show off. So many vehicles to craft. So many ideas. Which one's got the cloaking device? And then we've got these Steppenwolves. Look at this thing, man. We, we showed off the... Uh... Ooh, the meteor looks cool. We showed off this these mech walkers. I wonder what a mech walker would look like. I don't even know how to unlock the legs. We're, we're still working to unlock wheels. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Two videos a day. If you want more, you know what to do. Baron's Brigade, where are you at?